to, to start with, uh, I thought that was a phenomenal defensive effort by us. And we talked a lot uh, yesterday about getting back to our defensive identity, uh, which I just didn't think we'd had really in our last three or four games. Uh, they run a lot of stuff. It's hard to guard. Uh, Jason Kemp had the scout and did a phenomenal job of getting our guys ready with the, you know, paring it down that we could be ready in one day, which is not easy to do. Um, we struggled offensively, you know, for most of the game, but uh, I thought we had some good shots that we missed. And um, and then Miguel Aesa came in, in the second half off the bench and I thought it gave us a really good spark. And um, happy to happy with the way we played and happy to get the win. I felt like it was a little bit more a matter of shots falling. Um, you know, I think that I, I think throughout the course of the game, we we stuck to our defensive um, our, our defensive plan. I thought that was really important. That's hard to do sometimes when you're not seeing the ball go in on the other end. Um, but you know, I, th I think that the the one thing that did get us going a little bit offensively, we got to the foul line in the second half. Luke Lowy did a great job of just getting in the paint and kind of, you know, getting us going. Nate had a couple of free throws. Uh, we got to the line early. Uh, I thought that that just kind of got us over the hump. And then, like I said, you know, Miguel came in and hit those two threes, which I thought were huge. And and then Luke Luke hit a couple as well. Was there any one major key you adjusted at halftime after they closed it to four? You feel at the end of the half did you make anything special to really spark them? Not really. No, it was it was a lot of you know continuing to play the way that we were defensively. Again, we just talked a ton about that. Um, like I said, on the offensive end, um, I, I thought the only thing that we didn't do a great job of at time was was really try to get the ball around the basket, whether it was post ups or paint touches. And I thought we just settled for some kind of around the perimeter threes. Um, you know, the ones that we hit in the second half were were really good inside out. You know, kick out threes that. Say so we get those shots, we'll, we'll shoot those all game. Um, but I, I give our guys a lot of credit for just being able to stick to that defensive mindset, like I said, which is not always easy to do when the ball's not going through the you know, for us. Let's first look at December. What have you learned about your guys so far? Um, well, I've, I guess I've probably learned a lot about them through, you know, through the start of the season. Um, I think that what, what this group has done a great job of is focusing on our on our preparation. And um, we talk a lot about our, our core values, our preparation, and then performing at a high level and let the results take care of themselves. And, you know, that's that's game to game, but that's also possession to possession. Um, I think tonight's game was a pretty good example of that. I thought we were playing the right way. I thought we were playing. Uh, it, it doesn't sound right to say we were playing at a high level offensively because, you know, we weren't making shots. But I thought we were running offense pretty well. and. Um, and this group has done a really good job with that. Um, I think that I think this group can continue to get a lot better because I thought tonight was a was a great defensive effort with a you know not our best offensive output. And I think if we can put that stuff together, this this team can continue to really grow. Yeah, um, you know I think that. You, know, you keep telling your guys shoot, shoot the right shots, shoot good shots, and you want them to do it with confidence. At some point, you got to see the ball go through the net. Um, it's not easy to get your number called midway through the second half when when you don't play in the first half. And Miguel went in there. I thought the first thing he did was was defend at, at a high level for us, and then he got the good looks that that he needed and uh, and, and knocked them down. And I thought that gave a real, real good emotional boost to our team, and you know, I think that that's one thing that this group has done a really good job of is rally around the success of others, and and that was a really good, you know, example of that tonight. Now, coach, you mentioned they run a lot of stuff and they're hard to guard. Um, any particular defensively you wanted to take away? I know you want to be sound all, all around, but what are you, when you're facing them, what are you supposed to do with the priorities? Yeah, so the the big ones coming in were transition defense and, and keeping them off the offensive glass. Um, as it pertains to running their actions, um, they run a ton of stuff for, for Green and Godwin, and those guys are really dangerous off of screens and when they have some space. And we really want to do a good job of staying tight to those guys. And then when the passes were made, the guy on, on the guy who just passed it 
we want him to really jump at those guys and crowd them. And, and I thought our guys did a nice job of that. Um, and then really just getting, you know, when, when the possession continues, just keeping the ball out of the paint. And uh, I thought we had gotten, for, for us defensively, we'd been split a lot and guys were getting to the rim way too easily. And, you know, having that, that emphasis tonight, I thought our guys did a great job of that. Yeah, for the most part, I was. Yeah, I thought that um, you know we talk a lot about having make teams earn their baskets, and in particular when you're playing against scorers that that are as good as those guys are. Um, you know, we're not shutting anybody out this season. <laughs> um, we're not shutting any. You know, most likely we're not shutting any any elite players out. But uh, if they have to really work and, and earn their baskets and make tough ones over the top of of good contests and a good crowd. We'll take the ball out and, and go down the other end and, and play offense.